I picked up an ASRock CPM 2.0 module. I always wanted to know how these things worked, but because I already had a board that had the, the pins for it, I went ahead and got one very cheap. My ASRock is the model you see on the screen, the Z270M-ITX-AC. It runs right now on i5, 6500T. I'll probably upgrade it to an i7, 6700. Not the T model, but the regular 6700 model. It takes more wattage, but it's, at least this is a regular motherboard. So you notice the module has eight pins. Huh, make that 18 pins. One's blocked off so you don't put it the wrong way. And the layout of the motherboard, this being the back right here, where I'm moving the mouse, and the green arrow points to the header where it would be, a couple of slots away from the RAM. Uh, on this other board, they actually have the actual picture of the board. The big green arrow, that's where the pins are. It ain't going to be that easy because I got fat fingers, but we'll see what happens. All right? Oh, let's keep going. Okay, here's a shot of the module. I'm using my regular camera right now. Uh, you can notice there's 18 holes in there. One's blocked off, so if it's on right, you can't get it on the wrong way. And one side says TPM 2.0. And the other side says same thing and some numbers, whatever it is. I hope this thing works. I'll try to get it on the motherboard. Uh, I'll try to take a picture of it where it goes on the motherboard. But if I can't, I'll just put it in and we'll show the results on the BIOS. All right, so here's the BIOS before I put the TPM module in. Just on main, tweaker. This is on my particular motherboard, okay? It says advanced. And when you go down to, in my case, trusted computing, I think that's where it acknowledges the TPM module. I don't know. I'm hoping for the best. All right? So when I put it in, that should show that it's there. So I'll do this. Then I'll show where it goes on the motherboard. Put it in. Then see if it pops up on the uh, BIOS. Okay? All right, right down there, you can see in the board, right close to the M2 card. I'll put my stick in there without hurting nobody. Right there is the pin connector, two, four, 18 pin connector. So what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna video me putting it on, but it's not part of this video because if I screw it up, I'm not gonna use it, okay? So, there you go. Okay, it's on, but I don't know if I'm going to show this whole video how I got it on, because it's really confusing and my hands are fat. So, let me go the rest of the way and let's check the BIOS. All right, the TPM module's in on the motherboard. Hope I did it right. I'm kind of clumsy. Let's go over and see what we got in advanced. Trusted computing. Bam, TPM 2.0 device found. I hope it works. I got a processor that's not supposed to run Windows 11, but there's certain ways you can get around a processor. But I wasn't sure about the trusted module, you know what I mean? So hopefully this is a decent thing. Asus does the same thing. CWWK does the same thing, but they use Asus type chips. Well, I'm going to hope for the best. I hope you enjoyed this video.